Hello students, today I am going to cover file upload and download in PHP. So basically what is file uploading and downloading and why it is required and the practical example of file uploading and downloading we see in this video. Now what is file uploading and downloading? Uploading consists of posting photo, sending mail and all. Now downloading means getting data from the internet. Why it is required? There are necessary as it gets us connected to the world and help us get different information of the happenings in around us. It help us get our desired files and thus it is very useful. Now we see one example of file uploading and downloading. In the Nokri website we require to upload our CV or resume. So basically what happened we choose one file or our resume in our folder and then we upload and press the upload button and it uh, is so in the uploaded okay this is a basic things of uploading and downloading now we see one example practically for uh, to perform the file uploading and downloading we require two file the first is upload.php and second one is index.php and we have to require create one folder that is upload or download folder so in first file upload.php uh, we write the code of user interact with the user because we require the uh, the widgets to choose the file options and one button to upload the our file so this code is written in the upload.php file and the second file is index.php uh, in this file how we can uh, upload the file content in the browser uh, so one method is there the, uh, the method is move underscore uploaded underscore file method this method is upload the file content in the browser now we create one folder that is upload and download file why it required because downloadable, fold, di downloadable file directly store in the upload and download folder see here we create one upload and download folder in htdocs folder okay now we see the contents of upload.php and index.php file now the uh, to make a interactive website or, uh, or example we require the html and php both so our code is embedded with html so first of all we take one button and one file option here see the html code written in the html tag and the display content of the uh, website or uh, web page is written in the body parts so one we create one form so we take form tag and their attribute methods actions and encryption type here encryption times is very important because if we have uh, to upload our file in the server there are so many attacks are possible so we require to hide our data or encrypt our data so we require the encryption method so this is the multi part slash form dash data is the encryption method and after clicking the button we redirect on the index.php file so we write here action equal to index.php now we take one uh, widgets file so input type equal to file and we give one the name as the file and we take one submit button to upload our file now we comes in HTAP, H, uh, PHP content uh, what is creating file and displaying in uploaded files so first of all we creating file to upload here is a syntax to creating file to upload and uh, displaying all the uploaded file for that we write the code inside the inside the for loop because we uh, display all the file that store in the uploaded folder upload folder that's why we write here for for loop now we see the anchor tag is used for the uh, 
uh, hyperlink of the data or link to the other data same here uh, we make uh, pra we make practical for upload and download both the both the file so we here write a download equal to file and upload files see here the pass the a is a variable because it start with the dollar sign now the content of uh, upload.php is over and we see the what is the content of index.php in here see uh, we ha we use one method that is move uploaded file to upload the file content we require one method that is move uploaded file in that we have to pass parameters of file so that we create one file variable and store the file inside that variable and we write the move uploaded method and uh, pass the content of uh, that parameter and uh, we have to store the all the file in upload folder that's why I given the path here upload now we can run this program we require the XAM software and text editor for uh, write the our text so XAM uh, we have to start here already started now we run in the Google Chrome see here uh, one button is there choose file I choose any one of the file from here and then I press the button on upload see you will uh, know the file is uploaded and if I click in this file it is downloadable okay now you already uh, now i am know that you clear about this topic and thank you uh, uh, please like share and subscribe my channel if you have any questions the please write in the comment section and i uh, give your reply instantly